Welcome back to another video everyone. So we're gonna do a full day of training here in Mallorca and we're gonna start the day with a pretty epic bike ride. So we've parked up the car in Bonyola and we're gonna cycle up Solaire and James is gonna hopefully get some real nice shots up there. It's quite an iconic climb on the island because it's just littered with switchbacks. So on a TT bike, it could be interesting, but I mean, it's gonna be enjoyable nonetheless. We'll drop down into Solaire up Pugmoyur, which should be like an hour climb. Uh, yeah, gonna be interesting, might get quite warm, but regardless, it's gonna be good fun. And then we'll drop down towards uh, Yuk, Polenta, and then back around to this location about here. So it's gonna be roughly 75-ish miles, fairly hilly to start with, and then flattens off a little bit, so I'll make use of uh, having a TT bike. I think I'm gonna get a few interesting looks having a disc but uh, it's the only wheel I bought because of the race. So, um, sorry, <laughs> I look like an absolute chopper. Uh, and then we're gonna finish off the day with uh, some other bits and bobs, but we'll, um, we'll talk about that later on. But for now, yeah, let's crack on and enjoy the ride. Just uh, the first few switchbacks of Solaire, and uh, yeah, I can already tell today is going to be a banger. Road surface is a little bit questionable down here, but um, yeah, it's already really hot, uh, and I'm trying to not go too hard up here, but all I want to do is smash it. <laughs> so, yeah, look at this view though gonna get better at the top so I'm gonna crack on and try and find James somewhere. Spectators. So I just crested Col de Soler and I'm just gonna shoot down now and enjoy some of the switchbacks. Yeah baby. Here we are, the start of Pogmoyer. So I believe I'm at the start of Pogmoyer. I've never cycled up here, I've only gone down. And it's a bloody long descent, so I can only imagine the climb is gonna be even longer. Uh, I'm told it's about an hour climb, so uh, time to settle in <laughs> and not go too hard. I think it's the highest point on the island. So yeah, looking forward to it, let's crack on. So I'd say I'm about 15 minutes into the climb now and uh, it's an absolute banger to be honest like super consistent not too steep about four percent maybe average uh, my gear ratio is a little bit not ideal I've got 55 42 on the front and 11 28 on the back so I'm pretty much in my lowest gear trying to go as easy as possible but still maintain some level of consistency so kind of having to ride up here at like 200 between 260 and 280 which uh might sting later on today and tomorrow for what we've got planned <laughs> but gotta do what you gotta do eh <sighs> 40 minutes into the climb now or just over 40 minutes Really long one, isn't it? But I'm very glad it's a bit cooler up here at this altitude. So 
they're sweaty. Yeah. I've nearly run out of water and I've run out of gels. So, fingers crossed James is at the top. Banger of a road though, absolute banger. Uh, made up Pugme or how are you feeling? Yeah, good actually. Um, don't know what my time was, but it wasn't really, well, I was having to push on a little bit because of my gears, but uh, yeah, felt really good and uh, rather sweaty now. So we're gonna enjoy relaxing a little bit over the top. We're gonna go through this tunnel here and hopefully get some absolute bangers. But um, <laughs> yeah, we'll see. There's a little bit of traffic um, and quite a few cyclists as to be expected. But yeah, we'll crack on. Bikes, people looking at Also bike ride done and done. We're back at the pool now and we've got something special lined up. So uh, James, who normally does the filming and the editing <laughs> and all the important bits, he is actually, what would you say, ex-world-class swimmer, would you say? World-class. World-class. World class. World class. He's basically said class. if he yeah. was involved in triathlon, he'd, uh, he'd be better than Andy Horsfall Turner. So Andy, you're a bit rubbish, aren't you? Nothing. What's um? So let's go through some of the PBs that you used to have. What was what was your bread and butter distance? Uh, what did we say last night? Four hundred freestyle. Yeah. Uh, I get I get two. I'm too modest. You see, I'm three fifty four. <laughs> three fifty four. Three minutes fifty four for four hundred. That's pretty much a minute quicker than my PB. <laughs> that goes at fifty eight seconds for hundred. That's um. What are your other PBs? Like? Uh, two hundred. 200, what are you just chopping? Yeah. Uh, 148. 148. 148. So basically, what we're going to do today is get in the pool and we're going to have a little race to see if James has still got it against a pretty average swimmer, which is me. <laughs> and then we've got Brett here who's going to do some filming. But let's see your Don't battle scars, mate. What's, what's happened to you then? Uh, so 25k into the bike, I basically lost control, went, well, was going around the corner, overcooked it, ended up falling down a slope into some hedges and bushes and sliced my nose quite badly in the end. Yeah, More than up. I thought I had. Well, um, so I've currently Hang got we'll get... a number of stitches in the yeah, nose as the doctor was able to peel my nostril away. But your bike's alright? Bike's fine, everything else is fine, no other injuries, just the nose Mate. and still managed to finish. And we'll chuck a photo in of what he looked like running out of transition because that is a <laughs> banger of a photo. <laughs> Yeah, we, we, we like, won't put the photo of his uh, nose in the doctor's surgery. Yeah, that yeah. was actually a bit grim. That's quite grim. Yeah, it's a bit sensitive. Yeah. So, um, so yeah, we're going to do this race and see what happens. If I lose, I'll be very upset. But also, we are screaming. Yeah. <laughs> All right. Screaming. Chances are <laughs> uh, slim to none. <laughs> and I'm he's actually wearing board shorts. I'm wearing board shorts. And he's got a dad bod. And got a dad bod. Two <laughs> referee. What are the rules? So the rules are. Push off the wall, uh, 25 meter all out effort, followed by a 50 meter. Yeah, if it was both a dive, I wouldn't be confident because my dive's terrible. Okay. I will be the uh, judge, jury, and executioner of the winner. <laughs> you ready? All right, three, two, one, go. I was blowing. <laughs> Put it in the comment section below who you thought won that one. And now we're going on to the 50, aren't we? This one's double or quits. Yeah. Three, 
two, one, go. Oh, the endurance kicked in there. Ooh. I think Harry got them. Uh, we have a winner. Uh, uh, beat me to 25. Board shorts. Good job, mate. <laughs> well, he won the swim. He won't win tomorrow. <laughs> we'll go a race off Sacalabra tomorrow, so. Yeah. yeah. We'll get him back. We should do more competitions like this. Athlete versus videographer. So get some ideas in the comment section below. Let us know what you what you want us to do. So I just finished a really good day of training here in Mallorca. Really nice bike ride and then finished it off really nicely with a win against James in the pool. So Not I'm pretty much a legend, <laughs> world-class swimmer over here. We're gonna plan another, another competition tomorrow and that'll be in the next video. And then, like I said, any other competitions you want us to do against each other could be quite funny. Uh, drop them in the comment section below. But yeah, really enjoying our time here. We've got a few more days, gonna get some extra bits of content. Yeah, hope you're enjoying it. So we'll see you in the next one. Buenos Aires.